As you know, people have been rushed into the grocery stores trying to stock up on any food that's left, paper products leaving the store shelves empty, and that causes a, it's a stressful visual, and people then respond accordingly in a high-stress way. The FDA says it's not necessary and that you should only be buying enough food to last you and your family a week. Yeah, please don't go in there and take everything. It's not fair to everybody else. Well, one of the big concerns, the elderly, and so that's why on Wednesday, some grocery stores are only going to allow senior shoppers inside when they first open up so they can get what they need. So Jamie's at the bashes near 7th Street and Bethany home to explain how this is going to work. Good morning. Good morning. What a difference one hour makes. That's the one hour that the seniors have uh, to shop ahead of everyone else. This parking lot was packed. You just kind of feel the calm after the storm here now as actually the rain starts to pick up. But every Wednesday, Bashes, Food City, and AJ's doors will be open from 5 to 6 a.m. for those 65 and up. Valid ID is required. One caretaker is welcome and purchase limitations are in effect. Uh, folks told us that some 300 people were lined up here. We kept our distance. One gentleman told us how things are in the store. Well, milk and eggs. Okay. There wasn't any toilet paper or hand sanitizer, any of the shortage items. So the, to the paper shelves were already cleared off, yeah. I Meanwhile, you know, farmers markets are trying to stay open to provide Arizonans with locally grown food. We have learned the popular Uptown Farmers Market will be closed today. It takes place Wednesdays and Saturdays in the parking lot of the North Phoenix Baptist Church. But the church closed its campus and the owner of Uptown Farmers Market says access to local food is important. We are one business, Uptown Farmers Market, but we're made up of over 200 small businesses if you put both of our markets together and the food trucks and we felt like the it's important to still have access to local food. Uptown Farmers Market is now trying to find another location to set up shop for now. Some of its vendors like Los Mortos Salsa are providing delivery service. And again, this is the first uh, day of senior hours here at Bashes. This is going to be happening from 5 to 6 a.m. at every Bashes, AJ's and Food City. Target is following suit on Wednesdays. The first hour of business is designated for our seniors. And then it's Dollar General who kind of started this trend here, announcing early in the week, asking all of its franchises to designate the first hour of business to seniors every day. Back to you.